A Democratic state senator in New Jersey, his name is Bob Smith, he wants to ban all bags from grocery stores. Not just plastic bags, but paper bags too. And plastic straws and styrofoam containers. He says his bill to ban bags aims to change consumer shopping habits and make shoppers bring their own bags to the grocery store. How creepy is that? He wants to change our habits. These virtue signaling leftists think they can run our lives better than we can. Well, newsflash, this is called social engineering by the government and the people of New Jersey should reject it. Listen to where this bossy Democrat got his idea to mandate that we the sorry people aren't allowed to use paper or plastic bags at the grocery store. He got the idea while vacationing in Aruba. How elitist. But any tyranny in the name of the environment is okay with the left, right? Makes you wonder how much jet fuel and what kind of carbon footprint State Senator Smith left on the precious environment with the jet he rode while he was globetrotting for ideas on how to control the people. No plastic bags and no paper bags at the grocery store? Really? What do you want us to do, carry $150 worth of groceries on our head? And don't give me the bring your own bags chick. It's actually gross to bring your own bags to the grocery store, and here's why. Think about where people put those bags. They're stuffed in people's trunks with kids' soccer cleats. They're tossed in the mudrooms of people's homes. They're exposed to the ground, which is full of fecal matter, and they're exposed to people's pets. Do you know how many germs those reusable plastic bags carry? And guess where people put those reusable plastic bags? Yup, right on the conveyor belt with your food. Listen, we all care about the environment. We all care about plastic littering our oceans, but banning plastic bags, paper bags, plastic straws, and styrofoam containers is not the answer. It's stupid, and here's why. Of all the plastic in the oceans, only 1% comes from the United States. Of that 1%, only 0.03% is plastic straws. That means of all the plastic in the oceans, plastic straws from the United States is just 0.0003%. That's right three ten thousandths of a percent. But this is what the left does. They virtue signal and claim the moral high ground in order to enact more control over us and our lives. But make no mistake, it might sound absurd to think that banning plastic straws and paper bags is a threat to your liberty, but liberty once lost is lost forever. And if we allow politicians to dictate what we can do and what we can't do under penalty of the law, where does that end? And that's my final point.